Hey, today we are looking into a Chinese projectors. And I have a whole range here. From an entry budget option to a fancy model from Xiaomi. So what's the difference? Well, size, picture quality, and extra features. And the size is surprisingly important. A small projector is easy to carry, but more importantly, it makes the setup easy. Just mount the projector on the tripod, even a mini tripod. Adjust the focus, and you are set to watch your favorite movie. All the setup took me less than a minute. But with the Xiaomi, I just put the tripod and the projector does the focus and everything for me. And alternatives? Well, those require some creativity. Not only to place the projector, but to adjust the focus and keystone sometimes for me takes even up to 5 minutes till I finally manage to get every corner reasonably sharp on a big Full HD resolution. Now picture quality, as you may notice, a sub $100 model looks pretty dim even in a dark room. So I will have to double my camera light sensitivity to bring the image closer to what I actually see right now. It looks better, but it is still dim. And there are little details left on a white shirt, as colors look pretty washed out. The only advantage is that even at, seven, even at 720p resolution, the image looks surprisingly sharp and actually better than I have expected on the cheapest model. Well, if we switch to the bigger with a bright model, you can instantly see that it's definitely brighter, with way better colors, and this is even at a half camera sensitivity. But still, take a notice that that white shirt, it is still overblown with very little detail in the highlights because this projector is actually too bright. Let's put the brightness down, maybe to around 30% and color slightly up. And it looks way better now. Good colors, there are details in the white shirt and in the shadows, and image overall looks very sharp at a full HD resolution. Finally, this picture quality is close to a TV image. Until we switch to the Xiaomi projector, and this one is definitely the closest to the TV screen. With awesome colors and top image quality, And don't pay attention to flickering, there is no flickering, it's just how projector light interferes with the camera. And I can put the camera shutter down, you can see that flickering goes away with the lower camera shutter, as it is completely unnoticeable with the naked eye. And here are all three projectors, try to guess which is which in the comments below. Well, the cheapest needed an increase in camera sensitivity, so here it is. And the camera flickering gives away the Xiaomi model. So I guess only the bright F20 is left on the right. And notice, as far as picture quality goes, Xiaomi and the bright F20 models look pretty close. Except Xiaomi has better colors and dynamic range. And surprisingly, even the resolution is the same 
1080p on both models, Xiaomi still looks sharper, probably because of those three red, green and blue color subpixels, because of the three lamps in this projector, and maybe autofocus, which gets every screen corner perfectly sharp every time. Oh, and did I mention that Xiaomi has been streaming this video from a home network? And it has pretty much every video and streaming app built in into the projector. Even some games from cloud gaming to a PC remote desktop. And both the bright models? Well, they couldn't even play a simple video file from a USB flash drive. Basically, they are good only for use with an HDMI. And I had to bring my MacBook to play uh, the video. So I guess you get what you pay for. I'm definitely keeping the Xiaomi model from the bunch. Even if it is the most expensive, I think easy setup with a tripod mount and auto focus alone is worth the price difference. And Xiaomi model offers the best picture quality. It is the quietest from a bunch and you get the whole 100 operating system as a bonus. And if you get 100 likes on this video, I will make a dedicated video about the Xiaomi projector. So hit that like button. And finally, second place goes to the cheapest Vivibrite model. Because it's just a good entry option if you want to get the cheapest projector just to see if you need an or like having one. And a full HD Vivibrite model. Well, this projector definitely had a nice image for the price, but setting it up, it is straight annoying. So, unless you are looking for a budget projector to be permanently mounted to the ceiling, I would not recommend it for anything else. Just save those pennies for the Xiaomi model and you won't be disappointed. Thanks for watching, hit subscribe if you haven't done that. And I will see you in the next one. I to climb something this year. Look, you're the guy that wanted an epic adventure. I'm the guy with only one hover chair. But damn it, an alien spider just bit my finger. It's an alien cliff. You can just say spider. Ooh.